All right, good Monday morning, Monday Sea Day morning, staff and students. This is Mr. Lon with your morning announcements, upcoming events. This Friday, quarter three grades go in. Yes, students, quarter three. We are at the end of quarter three. So let's do what we need to do this week to make sure that we are finishing strong. And if there are any assignments, students, that you need to make up during this week for this quarter, that you are doing so. And then next week, Thursday the 30th and Friday the 31st are half-day report card conferences. And students, as always, our number one priority as educators at MassBomb is to keep you safe and healthy so that you can learn. That means reach out to a staff member that you trust if you have concerns or problems because we are here to support you. All right, students, you know about our 90% attendance initiative. That means out of 23 days in March, and we have... Two more weeks left in March. You must be present for 21 or more of those school days. There are great incentives for doing so, including Games Day on April the 13th by special invite, by fruition of being part of the 90%. And students that have the 90% achievement and zero class cuts they are going to be in a raffle for a bunch of gift cards, $100 gift cards. That's really that's really great. In the way of clubs meeting today, we have the Spanish Media and Translation Club with Mr. King in room 605. We have the Tabletop Games Club with Mr. Thomas in room 407. We have the Gamers Club with Mr. LaMumba in room 323. Rubik's Cube Club with Ms. Walker in 313, 7 to 7.30 a.m. Reminder about Kuth and bracelet sales and Chromebook repairs and social media and March Mammal Madness. All right, we have some winners. I'm going to announce the winners. Advancing in round one, the dad bods bracket are the Wolverine, the Owl Monkey, the Bat-Eared Fox, the Pacific Spiny Lump Sucker. All right. The Dyak, is that how you say that? I'm not really sure. Fruit Bat, the Greater Rhea, as opposed to the Lesser Rhea, the Emperor Penguin, and the Semang. All right, I like that. I like those winners. Wolverine has to be a one seed. And in the Mighty Stripes division winners, this division students and staff is once again under protest because it doesn't include Tigers or zebras, but moving along. Combatants advancing. The striped dolphin. I didn't know that was a thing. The jackal. The kudu. The mongoose. The okapi. Now, I like a nice okapi. I have to be honest. The striped rabbit. The striped hyena. And the highland streaked tenrec. All right. Okay. Hey. Good work. Good work by all you animals that advanced. Continuing, Women's History Month 2023. Today, we at MassBomb are recognizing in honor of celebrating women who tell our stories, Miss Yakey. Miss Yakey, MassBomb's Community Partnership Coordinator, is a recent Haverford College graduate and native to Indiana in high school. Ms. Yakey competed in speech and debate where she learned to convey her opinions clearly, back up her arguments with fact and reason, and tell the stories of things that were important to her. Her specialty was original oratory, an event where she wrote and memorized her own TED Talk-like speech on pressing social issues. The most impactful oratory she delivered was on finding empathy and common ground in the midst of a toxically polarized political landscape. Giving this oratory taught her to stand up for the values she believed were right and to not be afraid to use her voice to make her stories known. Speech and debate gave Miss Yakey valuable opportunities to use her voice on issues that matter to her and gave her the confidence to grow into who she is today. Miss Yakey, we salute you today for Women's History Month 2023. The staff and students' shout-outs 
First, shout out for Mr. Lessie to Jaime Burgos, Lawrence Camp, Wilfredo Masonette, Ashley Rivera, and Daniel Sanchez for being on time and present. It's the first block of Biology BD Days, all three meetings of last week, and doing work throughout the class period. It was super cool seeing you all learn about genetic mutations and further preparing yourselves for the upcoming Biology Keystone exam. Hey, keep up the amazing stuff. Kids, great work out of you, Mr. Lessie. Great work out of you. And from Miss Walker, she would like to shout out Arad Ginez, Caden Martin, Kevin Thatch, Ethan Wynn, Sadiq Smith, Cy Caraballo, Jada Simmons, Rachel Paulino, and Nivina Norman for their work on the farm yesterday. Or that was actually last Thursday. Learning how to identify a maple tree was cool enough, but also learning how to safely tap the tree, collect the sap, and turn it into the sugar. That's something to blog about. Hey, kids, great work. And Miss Walker, great work by you for everything that you're doing for the kids on the farm. And finally, for Miss Barlow. Miss Barlow says, shout out to Dr. Riley for the sick burns. He dishes out consistently at 7 a.m. every morning. All right, Dr. Riley, I guess you're like the John Stockton or Chris Paul of sick burns. Nice shout out from Miss Barlow. I think National Days today is National Flower Day. That's kind of like flower, not like flowers, flowers, but flower, like the thing you bake with. It's kind of a weird national day, but it is the first day of spring and that's good. That's very good. Hey, students, let's close out as we do with our school vision of being builders. We're mass bomb. We build the future. Have a great Monday.